staying in Taiwan next, we meet Timur nurse Wang Jinghui from Tainan, whose first international relief mission was to the disaster-stricken areas of Typhoon Haiyan in the Philippines. Though medical resources were limited in the disaster zones, Wang was nonetheless inspired by the courage and optimistic nature of the Filipinos. I saw a little child just sitting there next to a pile of rubbish. Each photo tells a moving story. These photos were taken by team nurse Wang Jinghui from her cell phone during her medical mission to the Philippines. As Wang set out for the disaster-stricken cities with members of the medical mission, they came across many residents that arrived to seek medical attention each day. Seeing the disaster survivors' hardship and courage deeply moved her. When we were cleaning the wound, sometimes we needed to trim off the dead skin around it. It was actually extremely painful, but residents tried their best to endure the pain. I really sympathize with that. Once the free clinics concluded, Wang stayed behind to continue helping those in the remote areas. At best, a temporary clinic was set up on the side of the road, with just a table and a chair. Sometimes Wang would even rest their legs on her own thigh to clean the disaster survivor's wound. I didn't think that they were dirty or think otherwise of them. All I thought about in that moment was how to treat their wound so that they can get better soon. The greatest reward for Wang is not how much she gave, but rather realizing her own blessings. I will cherish each affinity and seize every opportunity to give. Seeing the hardship of the suffering ignited the compassion in Wang's heart, and she hopes to canvas the love of many more kind-hearted people to help support Typhoon Haiyan survivors on their path to recovery.